the ladies cannot help themselves with men that they find attractive, that they find sexually attractive. And if you guys hear some goo goo gaga, that's my baby girl in the background, all right? <laughs> but, uh, you know, the ladies cannot help themselves with men that they find appealing. You know, when they look at this guy, when they see him, yes, there is a physicality level, right? When they see this guy and they're like, dang, he, he looks good and he's cool. You know, he has that personality to boot that matches his appeal, right? Women cannot help themselves and there is a, a huge expl there is an explanation to this as to why the ladies are getting a bit more aggressive with what they want, right? Now, when a young lady is, first of all, let me say this, when a young lady is aggressive, sometimes there are motives behind it. There are reasons as to why she is aggressive ulterior motives but the only one i'm talking about on in this video is the one where she's genuinely interested right where she is actually looking at you and like damn i want him just as bad as you want her okay and there's a reason behind this to be honest with you and i'm gonna get right into it this is terry talks when a chick wants you she wants you she said she said look i'm looking at that boy i like you and i want you right and the thing about it is the reason why this is why young ladies are getting kind of aggressive and i'm not talking about the ones that have ulterior motives like getting what you got right if you're a successful guy you know some chicks will pretend like they like you or they're trying to scam you out of something you know that happened to me when i was younger uh th there were these scamming ass broads that would pretend like they're in it. You know, stuff like that, malicious. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about ones that are genuinely interested. The reason why they are somewhat aggressive is because there is really a lot of, uh, you know, uh, young ladies do not find every man attractive. You know, for us as men, I'll put it to you like this. We will smash something right or be intimate okay with something that my bad i looked at my little baby girl but do we will you know be intimate with a young lady that we really don't find that appealing okay just because we want something to do we'll do that way more often we'll do that way more often than young ladies young ladies are a little more selective they are a little more selective with who they mate with. Now, I know what some guys are thinking, oh, they mate with bums and all that. Yeah, some chicks find bums, uh, you know, appealing, attractive. Don't ask me why, don't ask me the explanation. It is what it is. But the point being is, if she does find you appealing, she's gonna go for you because they don't, especially nowadays, man, because women are, you know, they, you hear it in songs, you see it on social media, you see it on TikTok, IG, all that good stuff. Young ladies are not afraid to voice their opinion. They are liberated. Now, I'm not gonna go into the pros and cons because there definitely are some cons to it, right? I'm not gonna get into this video, but one or two cons are um you know the over promiscuity that's one and second it's really biting them it's really biting a lot of young ladies in the rear end because because they act so promiscuous they end up never getting and you know guys never take them seriously so they're constantly getting passed around so to speak okay but that's another topic for another video but with that being said since they're out there with how they really think and how they really feel there's no kind of cap there's and i'm not talking about the word cap like you capping i'm talking about like oh you capping or that bullshit i'm talking about there's no cap there's no limit to what they can express now even though it's still somewhat taboo but we see it all over the internet and stuff so they have no problem 
with telling a guy how they or showing him rather okay so when a guy makes the initial move or whatever like that she is extremely receptive and she is very willing to do what he wants to do she's gonna make it make it very well known a lot of guys fall into the trap of trying to wonder if she's into him trying to convey her trying to convince her to like them still in this kind of disney romantic film type of mind state where they think that you have to convince a chick that you're worthy see that's the whole that's the whole um vibe that you give off like i have to prove myself that i'm worthy to this chick i gotta bend over backwards i have to do all of this fancy stuff and be this high ranked lawyer and you know do a backflip off a helicopter and and impress her and then she'll like me a lot of guys are still under that impression but when a chick really likes you dog uh, you're gonna know you're gonna know because it's gonna be extremely easy and a lot of guys man they kind of it, you know they kind of get um a little irritated when they find this out like dang these chicks really out here just getting with guys they find super attractive you know they'll get with them on the first night they'll get with them when they made joe schmo think he has to wait okay joe schmo thinking thinking you know he has to wait and earn her uh approval and he's got to meet her parents and all that while you know johnny cage over here the cool the the, the dude she found attractive got it within the first night second night something like that okay now don't i'm not like these other uh manosphere videos where i'm like oh all women smash the guy that they're interested on the first date and stuff i don't know that i don't know that is that a highly likely thing yes but the word the a word all i'm never going to use that because i don't know all chicks some chicks might have a thing where you know they're kind of conservative where they're like i don't want to do this on the first night because i want marriage i want something serious and that's not something that the guy might get the wrong impression but even with those type of chicks they're going to be very pursuant they're going to be very consistent they're going to be all up on the dude see the thing about it is guys women live very active social lives okay that's the thing we have to understand they live they live very active social lives like us as men we can have like one friend hell even even sometimes we won't even really be going out like that a lot of guys just chill play video games you know that's that's their whole thing that's how they socialize they play call of duty madden uh two K, whatever and and call it a day that's that's cool that's they'll be all right with that they'll see a homeboy they'll see their homeboys once or twice a week you know drink a beer go to a bar shoot some pool but they're content with that young ladies however they got birthday parties they got family they got friends of friends they got baby showers they got this and that they got group chats all that stuff so when a chick is really you know she's got a lot of stuff going on so when she's really into you she's gonna blow all that stuff off because she really wants to see you okay a chick if she really if she's really attracted to you she's gonna make it happen easy it's so easy and the reason why i make these type of videos is because i don't want guys out here thinking that they gotta jump through hoops just to get a chick's attention right i don't want guys coming from a standpoint of they have to impress i want guys to come from a standpoint of strength and the number one way to to do that is by canceling chicks that make it that make stuff very strenuous that just drag stuff out like if you asking them to come and meet you 
they make it like they're like i'm busy this and i have this and i gotta go to this baby shower because like i just stated chicks are always busy you know they always got baby showers they always got sisters whatever the hell in-laws birthday party and trips and cruises and all that but for if they're really attracted to you they'll put all that stuff off to come see you and a lot of guys don't realize that a lot of guys think that they should just take uh mistreatment you know what i'm saying because that's what it is you're getting jerked around that's mistreatment but they go out of their way they'll be intimate with you they'll do stuff with you right i'm just gonna keep it pg they'll do stuff with you that you want if you want to do something you want to go out you want to chill you want to sip on something no problem it's cool because she has that same desire for you and unfortunately a lot of guys you know never experience that it just takes a couple of tweaks maybe it's a physicality thing right maybe hit the gym maybe it's a personality thing maybe it's extremely awkward Okay, for my looks guys, because I know there's a lot of looks guys, you can work on that. You don't gotta be six foot five with a jawline. You can work on that. I'm not six foot. I'm not six foot, okay? Uh, there's plenty of guys that are shorter than six foot that is out here getting played because they have a personality. They have, um, you know, they work on their physicality, whether it's a haircut, whatever you wanna call it, right? And there should be, you shouldn't be guessing like, oh, does this chick like me or does it, it should be a pair, it should be very obvious because it's easy. See, I kind of got to a point and a lot of other guys got to a point where if things seem like they're kind of jerky, you know, she's kind of on the fence about it. I got to a point where I'm like, I'm not even, it was on to the next one super quick. And guess what? Those chicks that I moved on from, they never hit me back up because they were never interested in the first place. Then when I did move on to a next one that was interested, man, it was so, it was smooth. Oh, hey, what are you doing? And this is her. Hey, what are you doing today? Let's get up. Let's blah, blah, blah. You know, anyway, so I hope this video helped. Let me get back to doing what I'm doing. Hope y'all enjoyed. Peace.